Welcome to MonroeMotors.com. Here we have a 2004 Chevrolet Corvette Coupe in torch red on black leather interior. So we'll just start over at the rear of the vehicle. Um, this one does have the removable target top, which is color matched to the vehicle. As you can see, it fits nicely here in the trunk. Um, this does uh, fold up like so, and there is additional space here on the bottom. We've got the color matched front license plate cover here. Uh, if you see here, this is a lock and there's also another lock. Uh, so when the top uh, is laid down, we can um, pull that lock up like so, and it holds the uh, top in place. Um, we also have the privacy netting or privacy screen here that's on the up, upper portion. Uh, so when this is uh, closed uh, like so, uh, you can't see the items underneath. Um, we've got the nice Corvette logo with the uh, blacks around there. I'll just step back. We've got the circular tail lights with the embossed Corvette logo there on the bumper. Uh, we've got the quad tip um, exhaust down below. And we'll just shift around this side here. I'll let you have a look at the rear wheel. Uh, so it's got the nice polished aluminum wheels. We've got red painted calipers, painted rotors, and nice Michelin tires on there. Uh, over at the passenger side, uh, here's the, uh, the door plate, uh, so it's in great shape as you can see. Uh, we've got power windows, power locks, um, the buttons are in great shape as well, and we've got a Bose stereo, uh, premium stereo in this as well. Here's the kick plate um, on the passenger side, and for our power seat, we've got power four, aft, up, down, power lumbar, and side bolster adjustments, and a manual recline. And I'll just go ahead and scan up the seat so you can see the condition. It's in really good shape. And as I get in, just have a look in the door frame, nice and clean. Have a look in the glove box. Um, there's the codes for anyone that's interested. I'll just uh, focus in on that. There you are. And uh, we do have the books there, and there's an airbag shut off there as well. Um, here's the, uh, the dash on the passenger side, so you can see the condition. Looks good. And we'll just hop out, and we'll close this side up. And I'll just step to the back of the vehicle and we'll move along this side so you can see the condition. Looks good. And here we are at the front wheel. So again, uh, nice polished aluminum wheels, red painted calipers, painted rotors, and nice Michelin tires. Uh, under the hood, we've got the V8 5.7 liter motor, which is 350 horsepower. And that's paired to a four speed automatic transmission. It's nice and tidy, looks good. So we'll go ahead, we'll close the hood. I didn't quite close it there, but that's okay. And we'll just move to the front. Um, so we've got the nice flip up headlights there. Um, we've got the black uh, Corvette badge. It's in good shape as well. Um, we've got fog lights over on the side and same thing over here um, in terms of issues. Um, there's, a, there's, there's a couple small little tiny um, stone chip marks here on the front, uh, which is expected with the age of the vehicle. Um, you know, nothing major. There's one little guy there that we can uh, uh, touch up. Um, but uh, overall, it's in really good shape. So we'll just move around this side here. Here's your front wheel. So again, uh, nice Michelin tires, polished aluminum wheels, red painted calipers, painted rotors, and same thing back here. And we'll move on to the driver's door. Um, so we've got our two user memory seats. We've got um, power mirrors, power locks, power windows. Um, as you can see, that plate is in really good shape. Uh, that's usually a wear item on these cars, so it looks really good. Uh, we also have that premium Bose stereo. And uh, as you can see, the rest of the door panel is in good shape as well. Uh, here's the uh, kick plate on the driver's side. It's in good shape. Could use a little polish down there, which we'll do, um, but uh, overall pretty good. Um, so there's your power seat, power four aft, up down, power re uh, lumbar, side bolster, and a manual recline. And I'll just go ahead and scan up that seat so you can see the condition. Awesome, so as we get in, just have a look in the door frame, nice and clean, let's get in and fire this one up. So in terms of kilometers, we have 98,571. No warning lights or issues there on the dash. Uh, we do have the flip up headlights, so I'll uh, show you that. They go up nicely, no grinding, no noises, which is great. Uh, we also have cruise control on the stock there. Over here, we've got our fog lights. We've got our trunk release. We've got our manual tilt for the steering wheel. 
And then over on this side here, um, you've got uh, power telescopic steering column. Uh, so that's great. Move that back down. There's our turnkey uh, with remote. It's got lock on lock trunk and panic. Um, there's your radio. Um, so nice Bose stereo. Um, and then we've got uh, dual zone climate control down here. Um, and then below uh, this door opens like so. We've got a 12 volt socket uh, and an ashtray there. Um, so we'll close that. And then here's your flip up cup holder and it's working. Um, here's your active handling on and off. Um, emergency brake, four speed automatic shifter with leather wrapped boot. Uh, the center console, you've got your fuel door release, uh, 12 volt socket and felt lining. And there's your auto dimming rear view mirror. And now we'll just hop out with it running. We'll have a look and a listen. Nice sound to it. So I'll just show you from the front. Here it is with the pop-up headlights. And we'll just scan along this side of the car so you can see the condition. Nice rumble to it. Sounds good. Love the circular tail lights. Love the torch red. What a great combo. Sorry about the hood there. <laughs> There you have it folks, 2004 Chevrolet Corvette Coupe in torch red with black leather interior here and available at MonroeMotors.com. Come on down and have a look at this one for yourself. Look forward to seeing you real soon.